Brenton, is there extra whipped cream in there? Yeah. Well, uh, we've done a, there's a lot of stupid things we've done. This is like the top of the list, so let's do it. Uh, my mini goats love uh, entertainment, so we're gonna buy him a TV. Did you get the TV? Yep, catch. Let's go. All right, let's do this. All right, guys, I got you a TV. No, pickle book. Steven, you're gonna break the screen. Don't step on the TV. Steven, it's not just for you. We're in, they don't know what's happening yet. <laughs> this is, this is great. <laughs> this is, this is perfect. We got a power source right here. Oh, look at that. It's turning on. Boys and, and girl, come on in. If you mess this up, Steven, I'm, let me, I'm putting on a show for you. What do you want to watch? Steven, stop eating the TV. Okay. Oranges, grapes, there he goes. lemons, and There he goes, he's already eating it. Steven, <laughs> this is another go. <laughs> hey, call back. You hear that? Steven, look at Steven is getting off to the cow noises. Steven, look, yeah. That's right, that's a goat right there. That's a that's one of you. There you go, you're watching him now. See, you guys can watch this while you sleep. Watch. He's watching it. See? Okay, the goats are legit watching TV. Look at this. Oh, Steven! What is it? More goat mating video? Steven, Jesus Christ. What are you watching? You're only six months old. Steven. Oh my gosh. Waddles is watching TV. Waddles, hey, you watching TV, buddy? Let's see what you're watching. Oh, Waddles. Waddles, where's the, where's the remote? Where's the remote? Where's the remote? Who are you watching? Bro, we played it at the alpaca warning noise. Look at them. Look, look at them. They're just staring at the TV. It's okay, guys. That's the first time I've seen him move his head. Okay, I never thought this would happen. The alpacas were mesmerized by the TV. That, the greatest purchase of all time. This is fantastic. They, they love it. Okay, so we've had some delays, like in the Fanatic merchandise, like actually shipping, um, due to the coronavirus. But that's the same thing with like every company. And this one girl hasn't got her hoodie yet. And we've decided to get a hold of her mom and call her to surprise her just because she hasn't got it in yet. So we thought, why not make it a little bit better? So here we go. Of course I know who you are. Well, I have a surprise here for you. L look at this. What's going on, honey? How's it going? How are you? Good, you. <laughs> that's awesome. Thank you. I appreciate it. I never thought I'd be ever be able to talk to you ever. <laughs> oh. No, like it means the world. Seriously, like you have no idea. Well, how's your day going? Um, a little bit over a year. A year? Yeah. <laughs> Someone <won> the oil. <laughs> <laughs> little girl was shaking. That was adorable. This is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. The baby duck and the pig are playing with each other. Look at them. Look at them. Look at them. Oh my God, they're best friends. Oh my God, they're best friends. Oh my god. Look, he's laying down. He's laying down trying to play with him. Oh my god. There's no way. Waddles, bro, you have a best friend? And it's not, it's not me. Wait, wait, wait. I, actually, I don't like this. I want to be the number one friend. We're actually going to take you to Chick-fil-A. Yeah, we're taking you to Chick-fil-A. I know. Chad, it looks like you made a best friend too. Waddles, this is, this is fantastic. I mean, it couldn't get any better. Look at him. They're swimming together. Well, he's drinking, he's swimming, but that's, it's okay. This is an unusual day, I'm not gonna lie. I've got your average dog collar. Um, I don't I don't know how Waddles is gonna react to a collar, but we're gonna figure it out. Ready? Look at the freaking chickens. I know you got a fat neck, so I'm gonna tighten this. Waddles! <laughs> you got... Waddles! Let's go! I know, I know, I know. I don't wanna pull you. It's not tight at all, like it could slip off his head. He's just too stupid. God, Waddles, come on. Waddles is, uh, put it in easiest words, he's pissed. Waddles is pissed. <laughs> Sounds like a boat motor every time. Listen to that. Sounds just like a boat motor. This isn't him upset. He's just angry. He's like, put me down. I want to run. Okay, well, the other day we gave Waddles some Chick-fil-A. He absolutely loved it. But the thing is about Waddles is Waddles is the stubbornest little animal ever. He will follow me and play with me. But, but right now, he just wants to walk around and dig in the dirt. And you, he's going to be so happy once we give him Chick-fil-A. Boat motor. <laughs> Look, he's trying to come hang out with us. Hey. Hey, what's up, buddy? Yeah. Better be nice because we're 
we're getting you food. And you're lucky it's not breakfast time. Okay, so once we got to the drive through line, Waddles, uh, he was having the time of his life, I'm not gonna lie. The worker didn't really seem to mind though, which was whatever, but we made sure not to ask for bacon. No bacon. <laughs> no bacon. And then we got kicked out for filming. So we went to the next Chick-fil-A. And the worker absolutely loved him and decided to take a picture with him. So in the end of everything, Waddles had a blast. Bro, look at, look at Greg. <laughs> he looks like an idiot. Well, Waddles just got some uh, some food, and now him and the duck obviously are, are just laying down again. But I mean, we fed him salad the other day too. Okay, so other than that, oh, there's a there's a big fish in here, like very very large bass, and I need to check on him because I haven't seen him in a few days. The waterfall's been off, so the water's been a little bit more cloudy. So I want to I'm gonna get him out, check on him, make sure everything's good, make sure there's nothing on him, no parasites, no diseases, any of that. What are you doing? Well, let's get the net, and this is uh this is not easy. If I can get him first try. I got him. Woo! That's a big bass. Oh my gosh. Oh, got him. Got him again. Oh my god. Here we go. All right. Look at the size of this bass. So, we got a little mouth sore right there. Everything looks good. Everything looks good. Okay. All right. Adios. I don't know if you guys can tell, but he's sleeping. Dude, look how he's like not moving. He's just like, like there's so much flow right there. Oh, I woke you up. My bad. My bad, dude. Wow, this tank is clear. Oh my goodness. Hey there. Yeah, everything's doing fantastic in here. See, I've got to continue to build this treehouse for the animals though. If you guys didn't know, we're doing that. We're kind of like in the progress of making a treehouse, which is up here. And uh, believe it or not, this is, this is high. This is like five feet off the ground. And I have found these little people up here quite often. I waddles, no. No. So I definitely need to uh, go around the tree. I have a brilliant idea. Excuse me, excuse me. Okay. Now, let's see if they try and get up. Hi! Look at them, look at them. Oh, Steven. Oh, Craig. <laughs> I'm up here, Craig. Craig, what's up, dude? They're so confused, look at Craig. Oh, here comes Russell. Oh, there's Steven. I've seen two of them up here before. Craig sure wants up. Look at him. Steven, you're close. You're close. Hey, hey, what's up, guys? Waddles. Oh, I forgot I forgot to give him a salad. Oh, my gosh. Yep, there we go. Waddles loves these things, but on top of that, the animals do too. Oh, my God, they look absolutely dead. Look at Craig. Every time I come out here. Craig, what are you doing? <laughs> the way they swing their necks around. Look at him. Look at him. He looks so dumb. All right, sir. Look. Salad. There he goes. My man is munching on this. Try and give some to the duck. Hey, you want some too, Chad? Look at Chad. He doesn't know what he's eating. He's interested. All right, children. Put that in there. The ducks love lettuce. If I just sprinkle that out there, the ducks and the goats will eat that. Oh. <sighs> now, on the other side of things, the other main topic is, is what's going on with the animals? Because my animals are supposed to be taken away or whatever. So we got a phone call today, basically giving us the next step. We have to write up this like really, really in-depth email and then send it to this lady who's going to take it to the city. And then they plan a hearing. This is where you guys come in because you guys get to come to the hearing. We just got to figure out when that's going to be. So once we get the email done, I'm going to share it with you guys so you can see what it says. And then I'm going to find a way for you guys to meet up at the hearing and uh, interact if you don't live in Texas or if you can't get here. So that's some new news. I mean, aside from that, though, like, like all the fish are doing good. The electric catfish, especially. And uh, I haven't shown much of this recently, especially this little puffer fish. Hey, kiddo, what's going on? Literally the most playful fish ever. And I feed him snails. And we've got him up in there. Oh, yeah, hi. Hey there. But there's that guy. Hey, what's up, Bubba? He's every, dude, This thing is fantastic. I mean, look how clear this thing is. If I come from the side, that is crystal clear. With that being said, though, hopefully you guys went on to enjoy today's video. If you've got to join the channel, go ahead and join it. Waddles would be so happy. Look, he's wagging his tail because you guys are thinking about clicking the little red subscribe button. And there's Chad inside the water bucket. Oh my God. But no, we've got a lot going on. And I'm going to ask you guys to do this once again. If you watched to this point in the video, if you actually made it this far, you got to do this. I loved it last time when you you guys commented like funny skit ideas and I love to hear that stuff so go ahead go into the comment section and just let me know some funny things like with the animals and just in general traveling if you guys want to see me go somewhere I know due to the whole coronavirus we're literally just gonna have to get in the car and go to the most remote area ever away from people but if that's the case let me know because I'm out here trying to do just some crazy stuff I'm bored I need to go somewhere it just has to be away from people but with that being said thank you guys it means the world that you're subscribed and it means the world that you support me hopefully all of you are being safe and healthy and and me and uh, Pickle Boots, we will catch you uh, on the, the next the next episode of of Fanatic, right? Cool. Okay. All right. Peace.